when the internet first arrived in 1984, I made the bold claim that the internet will change everything. And so it has. And today we can see that as the Internet of Things scales up, it's going to form the backbone of our network existence for the coming generations. But now there's a new network technology which I also think will change everything. It's called the blockchain. It's the database technology behind Bitcoin. And I think it's going to be every bit as important as the Internet. And as I say, I think it's going to change everything. As you know, the blockchain is the database technology behind Bitcoin. But even if that digital currency fades away, or remains just a niche curiosity, it is rapidly being overtaken in importance by its own underlying authentication system. A blockchain is a digital record of transactions. What's special about the blockchain database is that it is distributed and transparent which means that there are always copies of the records being made and circulated, and that makes it almost impossible to hack. Everyone in the chain knows instantly if an attempt is made to alter or falsify a record. Today, the blockchain database registers each time a Bitcoin is spent and changes hands. Because such a transaction involves checking the unique number and the digital signature of the token, a duplicated, copied or faked Bitcoin can never be spent because the database has no record of the fake token and thus would reject the transaction. In the last few years, many of the world's major banks have started to develop blockchain technology. Banks such as Goldman Sachs, JP Morgan, Barclays, Santander, Citigroup and so on have all got blockchain projects under development. And in fact, the world's major banks have now formed an international committee to set the standard for the blockchain of the future. In the banking crisis of 2007-2008, one of the main problems was that banks stopped trusting each other. But when money is moved and recorded on a blockchain, there is no room for doubt. Trust becomes automatic. This is a very important concept. In the near future, banks will be exchanging billions and trillions of dollars via blockchain technology. Soon afterwards, consumers will be using blockchain technology to pay bills and receive payment, including salaries, pensions and benefits. Blockchain will also end cash counterfeiting. Soon, all paper money will be issued with unique serial numbers and a digital signature, such as a barcode, which will be recorded on the blockchain. When someone tries to spend a fake $100 bill, a check will instantly reveal if the note is real or if it's been stolen. The blockchain will also make money laundering much more difficult. And when development money is donated to a developing nation using the blockchain, it will be impossible for any of that cash to disappear without everyone involved knowing who took it and when. Corruption in government and in business will be greatly reduced. Your personal credit record will also be recorded in the blockchain as will company credit scores. Intercompany fraud will also be greatly reduced. But however useful the blockchain may be proving to banks and governments, I suggest that this alone would not warrant the bold claim that the blockchain will change everything. I suggest that the blockchain is going to reach into our most personal lives. I suggest it's going to become a record of all of us and it will be central to who we are. A record in a blockchain can be about anything. The sale of a diamond, the sale of a house, the sale of stocks or shares, the birth of a child, a conviction for a criminal offence, passing an examination, being awarded a university degree, getting married, getting divorced, taking a loan, placing a bet, being issued a passport, making an insurance claim, and so on. Farmers will log their produce in the blockchain and the end consumer can be guaranteed about the food's provenance. Fishermen will record their catch and consumers can have a guarantee of its origin. All legal weapons will be registered on the blockchain and their history will be immediately available. 
your CV and work history will be on the blockchain and will be immutable. Fine art, cars, jewellery, boats, in fact anything of value or importance in our lives will be registered and tracked on the blockchain. Democracy itself will be revolutionised by the blockchain because distributed ledger technology can certify that you are who you say you are, online voting for democratic elections will become possible. The blockchain can ensure nobody votes more than once and can also ensure that votes remain anonymous. This has not been possible before. Today, few young people vote because it's an analogue process carried out in physical polling booths. The blockchain will allow all of us to vote with just a click. In the future, we will become blockchain babies. When we're born, an entry will be made on our unique blockchain. Our DNA links will be stored there. All of our medical records will be there. And as we go through school and enter work, everything that we do will be recorded, but with privacy, in the blockchain. This means, in fact, that our lives become the blockchain and the blockchain becomes us. Our final entry on the blockchain will be our death. <laughs>